Pisces, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name is Jen Dawson, welcome to Jen TV. All right, Pisces, I have been meditating on your word. And uh, I kind of got... Do, 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 do. Careless whisper. But it, it kind of kind of went from that to carelessness. So it's not careless whisper. But I'm 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 carelessness. It's it sort of felt like what have you done or what have they done that's been careless? It sort of felt like a a knee jerk reaction. Tell me more about this for Pisces, please. Bear in mind, my loves, these are general readings, so it's not going to resonate with all of you. But if it does, take a look at the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. There's also a link to my website if you want to book a private reading. I'm about to do a big hiccup. It doesn't feel like a burp. It feels like a hiccup. I'm, 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 not, I'm not being rude or obnoxious. I just feel like I'm about to go... <laughs> And it's not one of those, you know, when I'm I'm sort of channeling there and I get a sort of hiccupy energy. No, nope, I'm gonna do a hiccup, a genuine. I feel like Ugh, it's coming. Oh. I just had a vegan hot dog. It could have something to do with that. I'm uh, I'm pretty getting pretty close to being a full on vegan, and I feel good about it. I must admit. Just gotta stop eating bread now. Damn gluten. Anyway, Pisces, carelessness. What's this all about? Have I done the old blurb about general readings? Wow, you watch mine. You know, it's a, it's a general reading, isn't it? It's not for everyone. Patreon. <laughs> Anyway, that's beautiful. Look at that card. Wait. Wow. She looks hot. Oh, I could wear that. I want to wear that. Maybe I couldn't wear that, but I want to. Anyway, the overall vibe here, carelessness. So we've got the two of pentacles. So from one point or another, you were kind of juggling the best you could. You were, you know, doing the best you could. Then we've got the Eight of Pentacles. You're kind of focusing on... This sort of looks like home and, and getting the balance right in, in all of that juggling life. I don't think it was you that was careless, but take it out, it resonates. It could have been. And so why is the hangman here for what you need to know right now? Hangman in reverse. Uh, entanglement. It's <laughs> a very, I don't know, topical word of the of the year. Entanglement. Hmm. It was that last year. Time. You know what? Time. It's, it doesn't exist anyway. trying to get on with your life trying to balance things out and then this entanglement happens it's happening now all out of control and it kind of freaking hurts stuck being you know, between a rock and a hard place here you're sort of stuck in the in the It's like you kind of put yourself here. You've put yourself in this position. Take it out, it resonates. It could be them. There's, there's, there's some unorthodox behavior going on here. There's some sort of it kind of. I, I, I feel like it's cheating. I feel. of getting away with what you can get away with with my bare knee something it's 
so I showed my shoulder in one of the other videos today. I'm such a, such a saucy girl. Bared my shoulder. I was asking advice on, on what I should wear tomorrow for my day. I am going to wear what I'm wearing today. I've kind of got some witchy chic going on. And I'm going to wear my brown boots. Sounds good. Hat. You think the, the, the hat I usually... Yeah, you're right. Good idea. I don't think I'm going to go too much on the lips in case I get a snog out of it. Ding. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Should I should I put on lipstick? Should I? Let me know. Don't want to be presumptuous. 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 Oh, I can't even talk. Too excited. Anyway, it's not about me. This is about you. So what's coming up in the near future? This ain't going to work out. What you've been trying to balance. Yes. In, in the original... You've been kind of trying to balance things out, making home great, everything's good. And then there's this sort of feeling of getting entangled, entrapped, caught like a fly in a web. Getting away with it, just, it's not going to work. This is, this is going to be a whole lot of pain, a whole, I don't know, bag of worms, <laughs> something, I don't know, what it's, it's like, uh, it's, it's all going to kick off badly, really badly, really soon. Uh... And at first it's going to be like, no, what? And then after a while it's going to be like, oh, you know what? This is, I, it's actually a bit of a relief that this is happening. It sort of feels like kind of careless behavior that's happening now is it's actually going to be better for you in the long run. I think you're going to take some time out of this and uh, learn from your mistakes. I don't know if you're going to be single for a while, but you're definitely going to learn from your mistakes and not do this again because it wasn't fun for anyone involved. I think that something I need you to figure out is what love is and... I think that you're perhaps quite in love with the idea of being in love and fall in love very easily and it's it, it's time for you to sort of figure out what it really is. Is it lust? Is it love? And uh, don't give yourself away too easily. Take time out and learn from this. In the near future and, and the outcome here really is justice. So, you know, balance is going to come to you, you know. It, justice can, can also kind of mean, you know, consequences to actions. You know, it, it's... what you put out is what you get back kind of thing you know and I just don't think this is going to be a very fun experience for you it's not this it's going to be quite unpleasant whatever you get out of it you kind of deserve oh, I'm sorry to say that I'm sorry to be the bearer of that but I think you're really going to learn from it who's involved in this There's definitely uh, cheating involved. Do you want me to ask about the person here? I'm not entirely sure if it's... Uh, I. 
I sort of feel like perhaps it's them that's in a relationship with someone else and, and uh, you're just sort of seeing what you can get away with. But uh, karma's gonna kind of catch up with you on that one, I'm afraid. It, it just sort of does. I'm, I'm cool, like, you gotta do what you gotta do. Karma, on the other hand, likes to, uh, likes to do its thing. So, you know, if you're uh, responsible for somebody getting hurt, then, you know, you, damn, I'm gonna get yours at some point. It's just sort of the way it works. So just be careful, my love. I care about you. I don't want you to get hurt. I'm gonna take this into the extended. I'm gonna ask about this person. How do they really feel about you? I'm kind of actually, before I go into that, for free here, I sort of feel like you're a bit of a toy for this person to play with. And and uh, this person likes to throw their toys out of the pram. So, just a thought there, just a thought. I'm going to take it to extend where I'm going to ask how they feel about you, how they see you, uh, what are their intentions towards you, and what do they want to say to you, and some guidance from the universe. Well, let's have a look. Finishing off, please, for Pisces. Careful what you wish for, because you could probably get it. And uh, I've, there's a word that's coming to me, vermin. So if you're wishing for this person, yeah, you, you'll probably get them. But they're vermin. Please, some oracles. Don't let your past hold you back. Don't sort of keep following the same patterns. Move forwards. I'm just checking the time there. I've got to do the school run. <laughs> like all newsreader type people, I'm not wearing any pants. <laughs> Just this part's dressed okay, so I gotta go rush and put my pants on. That's why you got the bare legs. Earth school. Life lessons, soul growth, study, higher learning. That's what all this is about, after all. That's what it's all about. And one more. You'll learn from this, basically. Am I good enough for you? Am I? Is that what you're thinking? Do you think, are you good enough for this person? Are they good enough for you? Do you feel like you're good enough for anyone? Do you actually love yourself? Love you to death by typo negative. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch the extended, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon. You'll find the video there. Bye.